Hello, in this short video, I'm going to show you how to use the regression based tools multi dimensional scaling in the market stress simulation game version 7. Once you log into your market stress simulation game, you will see the main page like this. The right side is a decision panel, and left to the decision panel are tools. You see the regression based tools and multi dimensional scaling. And this tool is very similar to regression based tool, the semantics. The only difference is they use different dimensions to measure the actual attributes. For this one, they measure consumers' needs based on economy, performance, and convenience. So you can click on the regression based tools, multi dimensional scaling. I come to this page, it asks you the same question as semantics. So if you want to modify a brand to target desired position on a perceptual map, you can click this one. Then you need to select the brand you want to modify. The table will show you the actual attributes of that particular brand. Then you need to key in the desired position for this brand on the perceptual map based on the three dimensions of consumer needs, economy, performance, and convenience. Once you key in those uh, uh, attributes, and then you can just click on calculate. It will give you the exactly what are the attributes you want to use when you do the IND project. It will achieve the idea value for the three dimensions based on consumer's needs. Meanwhile, you actually can change your market. You can look at the Voda market, what you want to do. If you want to create a new brand to target desired position on perceptual map, you can click this one. The only difference is you don't have to select the brand. Then you need to key in the desired position of the new brand on perceptual map. Then you can click on the calculate. It will give you the physical attributes of the product. So this is how you're going to use this multi-dimensional scaling to help you do the R&D project. And I hope you enjoy this video and see you next time.